So, I am about to uh, ride two things I've never ridden before, which um, my bike still may be faulty with shifting, so uh, not really something I would advise people to do if your bike is not 100% you know, fully operational that you are aware of, then maybe you don't want to try new stuff. But uh, I really would like to try some new stuff to get some footage of some new stuff. So, helmet cam today, uh, new stuff, so I'm fully padded up because I don't know what I'm going to uh, run into. Um, so this first thing is I realized when I uploaded my K2 video, which I need to go down um, in order to get to the kind of like six mile trail system, um, I realized I saw someone else's video up there and they have a different variation of K2. I don't know, <laughs> it's hard for me to tell just by trail forks which one is the, the actual K2, which one has been mapped out through GPS. So I might be calling it K2 when really it's not. Like I go all the way down to the bottom when maybe I don't have to. Um, I, I mean, I don't have to. There's another, there's, there's a fork that goes right off there to the right. So that's the first thing I'm gonna try today that I've never done before after two years. Um, something that I, I've seen, you know, the, 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 the road there, like the path veer off to the right, but I've never taken it. So I'm gonna take that today. And also, I'm going to go and try up and over. I've just never done it before. Um, I've done Six Mile, I've done Violet Tendency, and you know, I just haven't done up and over. I've just never tried it. So today, that's what I'm going to do. Hopefully, I don't get wrecked. Hopefully, my bike is in tip-top shape once again. Uh, but we will see. Oh, pff, scared me. <laughs> Could be better. I've got a shifting issue that seems to still not be resolved since my chain just chunked up on me. Oh, no. Well, good luck on it, man. <laughs> Thanks.
uh, I didn't want to stop and check every time I saw a fork in the path. So I just picked one and kept trucking. And I always picked the left. I always went closer and closer to river trials or further away from six mile because I didn't want to like end up back on six mile. Uh, so I don't know if that was up and over yet, but by the time this is up, obviously I'll check my trail forks and see where I actually went. One thing I forgot to mention, I didn't bring my pump. So I have no idea what my air pressure was at, my tire pressure was at when I left. Uh, I'm assuming it just was whatever, I don't know, a little less than it was last time I filled it up, which was like five, six days ago. So another thing I would not advise doing. I'm exhausted though. I did all the climbs except for the first one. So I'm happy with that. But that first one, whew, whenever I do climb that, I'll be exhausted immediately after. I don't know, hope to clean it sometime this summer, but that's a tough one for me. So as you're already aware, I didn't do up and over, I turned off too soon, I did half cut. I didn't look at trail forks before I went because I'm a dummy. Anyway, that K2, I don't know if it's the original K2 or it's a very, well either way it's a variation of K2, either the original or not. Um, I might take that way all the time now, I don't really know. It's easier, however, it's more of a chance to get wrecked in a way because it's cliff's edge. But uh, I don't know. Man, I couldn't focus. I blew up by the end of that ride. Exhausted. I couldn't even climb Colbank's Trail the way back up. Um, I completely scrapped my plans for my ride because I wanted to go do river trials and like um, do double bogey and, and then go back up like the city by uh, that closed Botteril climb and like do scenic all the way back here. I don't know. I'm a mess. I, I don't know what happened. I do not feel good. And uh, yeah. But, um, yeah, that's, that's it. I, whew, I don't know. Um, yeah, I just don't feel good. So hopefully in a couple days when I get a chance to ride again, I will be feeling better. Um, my shifting issue definitely seems better. However, I didn't really get to test it as much as I thought because I just completely got exhausted. So I don't know, but we'll, we'll see what happens in a couple days. We'll see you on another time for another raw ride.